I've gone along the edge of the aileron where I had my one inch mark and I've painted glue. I'm using the U500 glue from Superflight and it's kind of a greenish color as you can see it there and I've glued all the way around the aileron from one end to the other inside of this one inch area. I've pre-glued that. <clears throat> I've taken and cut my fabric to length and size and on one edge I painted it with the U500 glue. I put a I like to take and put a piece of cardboard underneath the fabric and then just glue it down and I had marked <clears throat> a straight line. I took a straight edge with a number two pencil and marked a nice heavy line and then after that glue dried, I painted the glue on there, I took my scissors and I cut a nice straight edge and uh, you can see there's no string sticking out there, okay? Now there is sometimes you'll have these creases in the material when it comes off the roll. The fabric gets rolled on top of itself. Don't worry about that. All you want to do is down here on the edge where this is going to be going into the uh, being glued to the surface up here. And I find my finger here. There we go. Just take and pull that out as you glue it and stretch it and it'll come out so that when you glue that down you can push it down with the brush and it'll smooth out. The rest of it will pull out with the iron. That's no problem. So now I've got this is the bottom side of the aileron on the leading edge, the edge that the hinges are on. I've got it pre-glued and I've pre-glued the fabric. So I'm going to take this now and line it up on the edge of my one inch mark and take a little bit of glue in my brush and push it down into the fabric and the glue that's in the fabric and the glue that's in this fabric are going to meld together and then I'll have my one inch seam. I'll start at the front or the leading edge and wrap it around, bring it off, do the same on the back side or the trailing edge, let that dry then I'll come down and I'll trim off and glue down both ends and then when that's dry, I'll go ahead and shrink it.